Hi, in this video, I'm going to discuss how to manage failure. Hi, welcome to Personal Branding with Jolanda James. I'm Jolanda James. Thanks so much for watching this video. So in this video, I wanna talk about failure and how to manage it. In business, you will try lots of different things and they probably mostly will fail, but you only need one success to really, really make it. I always think back to a book, um, Howard Schultz, the founder of Starbucks and his story. It's one of the best biographies I've ever read. But one of the stories he shares is when he was first starting his company, he went around to all the most successful and rich people in Seattle. And he would have like 10 meetings a day and each meeting he would fail and he wouldn't get anyone. But he said like even on the 10th meeting, he'd have to pump himself up and get really excited before going into that meeting because he didn't want the up, he didn't want that person in that meeting to know that the other nine meetings of the day were failures. And that's that was like so big because he said, I think he, I can't remember the number, but I think it was like he he went to 3,200 people and he only got 199 to say yes. So he failed a lot, but then he got the right amount of people to say yes. So about failure in your business, whenever you, you put something out there and the end goal is I want people to buy it and then people don't buy it, you feel really like deflated and sad and like, oh, you know, like, oh God, but you don't have to. Instead of feeling like deflated about people not buying it, you can set up different levels of success. So one could be, you know, oh, I finished it. Another could be, oh, I put it up on the internet. Another could be, you know, different little things and then celebrate those different levels so that even if that one level, you don't achieve it, it's not an ultimate failure and it ruins your day or ruins your self-esteem. You can actually fail and still be excited because you're a step further along in your journey. So always keep that in mind. Learn to manage your failure. Set up different parameters of success for yourself instead of the one goal. That way you can feel good and be confident in your business. One of the things I've slowly learned about this business is it is not a sprint. It's a freaking marathon. It's a journey. So you need to be up as much as you can and learning to manage failure is a great step in that direction. So thanks so much for watching this video. If you like it, please like it, um, subscribe to my channel and leave comments below. Thank you so much and good luck.